pre-fertilization, stamen, microsporangium and pollen grain. Stamen The stamens are modified leaves of microsporophylls concerned with the production of microspores or pollen grains. It consists of two parts, filament and anther. Filament is long and slender stalk. It is attached proximally to thalamus, petal, Distally, it bears an anther. Anther is broader, knob-like, fertile part of the stamen. It consists of one or two anther lobes and accordingly, anthers are called monothecus or diathecus. The bilobed nature of an anther is very distinct in the transverse section of an anther. The anther is a four-sided or tetragonal structure consisting of four microsporangia located at the corners, two in each lobe. The microsporangia develop further and become pollen sac. They extend longitudinally all through the length of an anther and are packed with pollen grains. Structure of anther 1. Anther has two lobes, bilobed. Each lobe consists of two theca. Hence, it is diathecus. 2. Anther is a tetragonal structure which consists of four microsporangia located two in each lobe. 3. Microsporangium develops into pollen sacs. 4. Pollen sacs run longitudinally and contain pollen grains. Microsporangium A microsporangium or future pollen sac is a cylindrical sac which appears circular in transverse section. It consists of two parts, outer wall and central homogeneous porogenous tissue. Microsporangial wall has four types of layers, epidermis, common anther covering, endothesium, one to three middle layers, and tapetum. It is generally surrounded by four wall layers, the epidermis, endothesium, middle layers, and the tapetum. The outer three wall layers perform the function of protection and help in dehiscence of anther to release the pollen. The innermost wall layer is the tapetum. As the anther develops, the cells of the sporogenous tissue undergo meiotic divisions to form microspore tetrads. Each cell of the sporogenous tissue is known as pollen mother cell, PCM, or microspore mother cell. The process of formation of microspore from a pollen mother cell through meiosis is called microsporogenesis. The microspores are formed in the form of microspore tetrad. As the anther mature and dehydrate, the microspores dissociate from each other and develop into pollen grain. 
pollen grain. The microspores of haploid, uninucleate, minute spores produced in large numbers as a result of meiosis in microsphere mother cells inside the microsporangia. The pollen grains represent the male gametophytes. It has two layered wall, exine and intine. Exine it is the outer layer and is composed of sporopollen, which is one of the most resistant organic material. It can withstand high temperatures and strong acids and alkali. At one or more places, the exine is very thin or absent. These regions are called germ pores. In time, it is the inner layer and composed of pectin and cellulose. The cytoplasm of pollen grain is surrounded by a plasma membrane. Mature pollen grain has two cells, the vegetative cell and generative cell. The vegetative cell is bigger, has abundant food reserve and a large irregularly shaped nucleus.